Good happy Friday evening, September 4, 2015. I'm Riley King, and welcome to the Riley King Newscast right here on the Riley King Network. Let's get started. Police arrest man for driving 119 miles per hour on Everett Turnpike. A man accused of speeding down the northbound side of Everett Turnpike was arrested Friday morning by state police. Man claiming to be armed robber, Manchester Bank police say. A man claiming to be armed robbed a bank in Manchester on Friday, police said. Exeter celebrates 50th anniversary of notable UFO sighting. They say a lighting strike started a fire in Exeter, New Hampshire town hall that caused the cancellation of a UFO festival the first year it hosted by the local Kawans Club. Bush to begin television advertising with 500,000 three weeks by in New Hampshire. Republican presidential candidate Jeb Bush will begin his first round of television advertising of the 2016 campaign next week. A 500,000 broadcast cable and digital buy in New Hampshire. Judge orders partial video release of two officers shooting man. A New Hampshire judge has ordered the partial release of body camera videos showing two officers shooting and killing a man who lunged at them with a knife. Manchester Library has enough funds to repair West Branch damage. The West Branch of Manchester's library says it has enough money to repair the damage done by a broken sprinkler pipe. Funeral held for woman shot and killed while on walk in Manchester. Family and friends gathered Friday to pay their respect to a woman shot and killed last weekend in Manchester. Retired doctor 75 faces sexual assault accusations from 1980s. A retired doctor who had an office in North Conway, New Hampshire has been indicted on sexual assault charges involving female patients under the age of 13. Man arrested after gunshots reported near Red Arrow Diner. A Manchester man was charged with simple assault after witness reported hearing gunshots fire near the Red Arrow Diner early Friday morning, police said. Donald Trump expected back in New Hampshire in two weeks. Republican presidential front runner Donald Trump is expected to return to New Hampshire in two weeks. Merrimack man shot by police remains hospitalized. A Merrimack man remained hospitalized Friday, a day after being shot by police officials said. Police seize crack, cocaine, heroin in Manchester raids. A series of drug raids Thursday in Manchester needed authorities crack, cocaine, heroin, and other drugs worth 
thousands of dollars and more than 9,000 in cash and led to arrest of nine people. Fired Massachusetts officer faces charges in connection with shooting hoax. The officer who allegedly fabricated a claim that a gunman fired at his cruiser before it crashed into trees and caught on fire will be charged Friday, police officers said. New Hampshire tourism officials predicted booming weekend. New Hampshire tourism officials are predicting a 5% increase in visitors this Labor Day weekend. China cyber sanction could come next week. San Cashins against China for cyber attacks on the U.S. private sector could come as early as next week, U.S. officials told CNN Friday. And that does it for the Riley King newscast right here on the Riley King Network. Have a great rest of your Friday night. Good night, everyone. Bye.